Hi everyone, this week's tutorial is the Jade Split. I hope that you've warmed up your splits really well before starting this tutorial. So we're going to start from an outside leg hang. Make sure that you pull up into your outside leg hang so that your waist is in contact with the pole. Sweep your inside leg towards your upper body in a horizontal arc. If you bring it straight over the top, you won't be able to get enough grip on the inside of your thigh. Grab your ankle with your outside hand and pull your leg towards your opposite shoulder so it crosses your torso diagonally. Squeeze the pole really tightly with your inner thigh and waist. This is your primary grip point. Place your inside hand on your hip. Squeeze the pole into your ribs with your inside arm. This is your secondary grip point. Unhook your outside leg and align it with your inside leg so that you're in a pike position. From here, you can extend your outside leg into a split. You can either keep your leg straight or you can bend your knee first and straighten your leg once your knee is past the pole. To get your split as flat as possible, make sure you're squeezing the glute of your back leg as hard as you can to pull the back leg down. And turn your knee out so that it's pointing outwards rather than straight at the ceiling. If you don't yet have a flat split, you can raise your front leg slightly above horizontal, which should help lower the back leg a little more and create a more balanced line. To exit to an inside leg hang, place the outer ankle of your inside leg on the pole. Make sure you're keeping your back leg as close to horizontal as possible. Then release both your hands and relax into your inside leg hang. To exit to an outside leg hang, lift your outside leg up towards the pole until your knee passes the pole and then hook your knee. Then you can release your inside leg and extend it behind you to return to your outside leg hang. If you don't have access to a pole at the moment, you can still practice your jade splits on the floor. The floor jade puts quite a bit of pressure on your wrists, so make sure you do these warm ups before trying it. Our starting position for the floor jade is lying on your back with your arms by your sides. Pike your legs and lift them up and over past your head and lift your hips off the floor so that you're balancing on the backs of your shoulders. For a right leg split, you're going to place your right hand on your sacrum with your fingers pointing to the ceiling and press your elbow firmly into the ground. Grab your right ankle with your left hand and then carefully extend the left leg into a split. Take your time here to make sure that you get your balance. Your hand should be like a tray, so make sure you're keeping your hips centered over your hand. All of the tips for a flatter jade on the pole also apply to the floor jade. To exit the floor jade, protect your wrist by exiting as carefully as you entered. Slowly bring your back leg back over to the pipe position and release your grip on the front leg. Use your core to lift your hips off your hand and then slowly roll down until your back is flat on the floor again. Thanks for watching and I hope that these tutorials will help you perfect your jade splits on the pole and your floor jade.